hello friends today i will show you how you can root any samsung device and i will use my samsung galaxy grand prime with model number this so let's start to root any of your samsung device first of all you need a uh, name called name uh, a software called Odin, which is made by CF Auto Root. Thanks to them, and it the Samsung cannot Samsung device cannot be rooted sometimes with the King Root, the famous one. So you need to first open your browser browser and type this one called Auto Root dot dot EU or the the link is given below in the description from where you can download the root file to root your samsung device i will be using today the mobile of samsung samsung galaxy grand prime and which has a model number this the model number is too important to root because if you choose the wrong model number it can break your device so watch the full video to decrease the chances of breaking your mobile so let's uh, search for my uh, model number you need to this is a whole table of all the samsung devices present in the world so you need to search from the table one the important thing is the model number as well as the android running android so the thing let me search my GH SMGH. It's an ascending order of name, so you can search with the name. Search. It might be a big video for you as well as me. G zero mass there only. G five. Oh, yeah, it's there. My model number is this. Let's see. Um, you can see. You can see this. Yeah. It's uh, Samsung Fortune. This is the name of the file which you'll uh, get after installing. And this one. And this after going there, you will find the Android number which is running on that device. It's also important. And the download link. Let's. Uh, you need to tap this one. Uh, and as compared to your model number, it's my model number. So I'm tapping this one. It's, it might show you in your browser that it's not uh, not HTTPS and not secure. So you need to proceed to download chain file from here. Mm. I've already installed it, so uh, sorry, downloaded it. So I will. It's in a zip format. You need to unzip it first. Okay. And then tap this one to download it. I've already downloaded it. Open the folder in which you have kept it. I've already unzipped it from here. If you don't have a WinZip, you can download it or Google it in the. A Chrome or uh, Firefox or something. There, here's it. I've already unzipped it. Then you need to open this one and uh, check check this one and tap AP. It will proceed to a pop up to select your root file, which will root your Android. It comes with the zip file which we have downloaded before. So if you have not watched it, then go before in this video. You tap this, and uh, don't tap this. Open, open it. And, uh, this will run something, and don't click the start. It will start the. So I will uh, not start it. Then let's go back to the phone. As you can see, I've already put the phone in the uh, power off. So you can you need to power off the phone 
and uh, and uh, if you don't know what's uh, download mode then uh, uh, it, it is you need to in Samsung you need to uh, tap this power button as well as the uh, power down and the home button together to reboot into the download mode to root successfully your Android Samsung so let me put this one also you need, to, you need to tap all together then you will be only successful I think it's went in the yeah it's it will show up like this as you can see warning a custom OS can cause critical something like this if you want to continue you need to tap the power up it will show up like the, you mark something like not good it's danger but it's not dangerous you need to downloading it will show up like this now you need to connect the USB this one to your computer and the other end this one with your Android phone you should also have the uh, drivers installed in your computer to root successful or otherwise it will not connect with your Android phone and not root it so let's then it do it, it will show up like this now let's go to the computer now it will show up in the computer that installing driver successful and let's go to the computer welcome back after uh, plugging your phone into the download mode and uh, connect it with the USB to a computer so uh, the last process you need to tap is the start button it will start your thing you need, don't need to tap this one so you have tapped it and the last thing will start it will start rooting your device and it will show up something like green here it will inject the uh, root <coughs> into your samsung and i have got here the and samsung something uh, like you can see this one something is going on here rebooting in 10 seconds okay and here you can in the computer you see something you are removed okay it's fully done your phone is now rooted it's and it's rebooting my phone is rebooting here okay don't fidget with your phone <coughs> reboot automatically um, let me see in the phone now let me check that out okay you can see here okay let us check if the super su is installed in your uh, app section let me check oh, where is it yeah it's super su we have uh, rooted successfully no thanks thanks to us okay new user it's installed yeah, it's rooted successfully okay wow okay you can uh, now check the root by by installing an app like root checker pro or something uh, normally I'm uh, installing it still let me yeah it's installed let me let us check if it's root app will not install root okay yeah it's, we know agree let us tap this it will pop up with the permission if it pop up means you are rooted successfully ok it says what's congratulations root access is probably installed ok that's for today and uh, please like share and comment and share this video to those who has samsung device and want to root it so ok let's end it today